Okay, guess what? Guess what? We have DPR Ian. I'm very, very excited. I've been wanting to, I've been meaning to get around to watching this um, because it's his new release that came out just five days ago. So thank you, Sarah, for the request for this. Yeah, I'm very, very excited. I know that this has a lot to do with his storyline and I wish I knew the storyline a little bit more. I really need to watch, um, like when I say storyline, like it's like a whole story of him, not so much like a made up storyline, I don't think, but oh, I think there's like certain elements that are used as like a, um, what's the word? Um, I can't remember the word. My brain's not working. But anyways, I really want to go back and watch his MBs from the start because I think I, I'd have to look, but I think I've done all of his MBs. Does anyone know? Maybe I haven't. I want to watch his MBs from the start to the finish because I don't know if you guys watched his um his interview with Anitra, say what reacts, but they spoke a lot about his story and his MBs and everything that he's depicting within them um and it made me very very curious to like go back and kind of like understand the storyline a bit more because <clears throat> I'm not really that good at understanding things like that like especially if like you're not heavily invested in like every detail and whatnot it's, you just miss it <clears throat> he is so dramatic in the best way but I just think out of a lot of the artists that I listen to his story is the most fascinating to me and fascinating in the sense of like um <laughs> fascinating in the sense of like I know that it, <clears throat> what he goes through is like quite hard so I'm not like wow that's amazing I'm just like whoa that's impressive what he's done with his music considering what he goes through <clears throat> she was talking about Maktub Maktub live Mm, so interesting Sarah so interesting all right let's go uh, Christian what an open
my god. <laughs> that was the most epic thing ever. Are you kidding me? First of all, I felt like I was a DEF CON for a second there. I don't know if you guys know what DEF CON is, but I don't even know if DEF, DEF CON still exists. He's like the most insane artist. Like, are you serious? Everything about that. Here, it's a state of emergency. What, DEF CON? Is a state of emergency for your country? It's the DEFCON is a um like a doof like a festival that used to be in Australia or Sydney. That's like that like this music. It's like music that like people you don't want to hang out with <laughs> listen to. But like I love it in this. This everything about this, the freaking visuals. I mean, the visuals are always on point for his MVs, but the sounds are so unique. Are you kidding me? I am like so blown away. I feel like the last song of his I listened to, I was like extremely blown away as well. I can't, I cannot speak any more highly of freaking dpr ian like <gasps> seriously sarah you could watch it a hundred times live you need to watch the visuals for this when you get home because oh my gosh i just love what he creates like i really just love what he creates the beginning of this God, am I are you guys like freaking out the beginning of this was so epic not freaking out but like did you love that I loved that what is dream perfect how am I not subscribed to that what's dream perfect regime is this where all this stuff is how come I wasn't on that it's so weird wow honestly I absolutely loved that I absolutely love that. <gasps> and now I need to go back and see what of his I haven't listened to. Um, and I need to just watch them from the start to the finish. I want to I wanna put it all together. That was insane. Well done to him for being so artistically creative. <clears throat> I bet you she would too. She would love that. I just want to know more of like, I think like, as I said before, like with his music creation, um, like I know that he creates music from both parts of his personality when he's in his bipolar state and when he's in his quote unquote normal, or I guess most conscious state. And it's just so fascinating, like what he can come, come up with when he's in both ends of that spectrum um and like metaphor that was the word I was trying to listen uh speak about before like I know when I said like when I was talking about him having a storyline I think the storyline is his journey but certain elements are used as a metaphor so I don't think I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a storyline in the sense of like what k-pop groups do like with a law I don't think he has a law but it's like his own story using things in a metaphoric way <clears throat> so freaking good I love him so good so so good all right he said that they have documented everything for years hope they get a documentary oh <gasps> that would be so epic oh my goodness It'd be so epic <laughs> 